There has to be something to the Vatican being so interested in astronomy. I mean, well, the, the Vatican's been interested in astronomy since the days of Galileo. I mean, yeah, they condemned him, but you know, then they're talking out of the other side of their mouth. You know, they had they had astronomers, you know, looking into these things while they're saying, "Yeah, no, over here." They're saying, "Hey, we should look at this over there." You know, it, they they just do that. They just play the game. You know, and and I I personally think that the Vatican, uh, especially the Jesuits, the Jesuit in interest in astronomy, I don't think is any different than the Jesuit interest in biology or anthropology or anything else. This is the the quote academic wing of the Catholic Church. Um, I, I think they they do these kinds of things. And I'll, I'm going to try to be as broad as I possibly can here. I think they they in, endorse scientific inquiry within their own ranks because they want to sort of be at the forefront of discovery for certain things so that they can render commentary on those things according to the theological system of the Catholic Church before anybody else does. In other words, they want to control the narrative. Um, and and to me, that's a, a very kind of normal, understandable human thing to do. I don't I don't assign any particular conspiratorial bent to the fact that the Vatican has astronomers interested in in astronomy. They they do all this this kind of stuff in other areas again because I think they want to be on top of of the, the subject matter so that they can be the first to comment. Oh, the, well, the, the the church you know we knew about this from the beginning and. And we're not denying this or that science. And here's how we, we need to understand this. Here's how it fits within, you know, Catholicism. Here's how it goes with this papal bull over here and, and this statement that the Pope made over there. We're on top of it. We're not Neanderthals here. We're, we, you know, we got this covered. Uh, you know, we're not, you know, country bumpkins here. You know, we are after all knowledge, you know, and, and God is the God of all knowledge, including the natural world. And, we have a complete, coherent theological system. That's why you should be Catholic, because we do have everything covered. You know, well, um, Mike, but, aliens are space brothers as well. Yeah, aliens are. You know, so they're they're already down this road of you know baptizing space aliens, which you know I just <laughs> every time I hear that I just want to just want to growl or something. I roll my eyes. At, you know, but 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 that that's a direct reflection of of their approach to you know, original sin and salvation. In other words, it's a component thought. So it's very natural that a Catholic would, would think that, you know, because they're, 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 they're assigning, you know, they're, they're, they're linking the intelligence issue and an intelligent alien with the image of God, which of course makes us brothers, you know, space brothers. And therefore somehow, you know, the atonement has to be, uh, you know, uh, you know, some issue, you know, for a space alien. So we need to, we need to make sure they're covered in the atonement. You know, so that we need to baptize them and take care of original sin if they have it. You know, they've they've got all these things covered already. They've just been down this road and back, and 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 they they do this with all sorts of disciplines, you know, charitably because they think that's their responsibility. The church, if if you believe the church is the repository and the protector of all truth, well, you're going to do this. If you didn't believe it, why would you do it? But if you do believe it, you're certainly going to do it. So on one level, you know, I think you know, charitably again, they're doing it because they feel some responsibility. But you know, a little, a little more jaded, I think they just want to control the narrative so that they can, uh, you know, appear to be, you know, the religious place to be that's on top of everything that that the world is into. You know, we're there. We're not like you know some group over here that's just they're still believing in the flat Earth or something. You know, we're, we're not that. We're over here where the real science is. So I, I think that's just part of it. Um, again, I, I, I tend not to be terribly conspiratorial on that. I don't see it as a as a shocking thing. They've been into science for centuries. Why would this be any different? 